The heavy rains experienced in the country being predicted to persist, there are fears of outbreak of waterborne and respiratory diseases spreading. Already that five people in camps have been confirmed to have contracted cholera in Tana River County. Sheila Chilangat has visited a camp here in Nairobi and prepared this report for us on the plight of the victims. For three weeks now, this has been home to these victims of flooding in Madare area. This room in particular hosting up to 48 people and for them night times are the hardest. Sisi wengine wana mattress tunapewa blanket tunatandika chini. Na unaona ikapata iko na baridi sana. Kulikuwa na outbreak ya kipindupindu. Akaanza kuhara, akaanza kutapika green they are worried that the mitigation efforts by the county government might be challenged by their large numbers. Kuoga ni shida, kila kitu wani ni shida. Chakula hata kupata pia ni shida. Yani atufurai sana. Atufurai, atuna raa kukaa hapa. Issues to do with uh, cholera. Uh, we already have uh, some in uh, Tana River. Uh, about 35 cases that have been cited and we will continue with the with our teams on the ground to ensure that we get the real picture the real numbers uh, from the ground kuna zile mitaa hasa zimeadhirika pale unapata boli ni moja na imefurika na mafuriko tumehakisha kuwa watu wetu public health officers na wale wengine wako pale kuhakisha kuwa yale maji yametibiwa na ni salama kwa kutumia in Maimahu, Naivasha, wounds of the horrific landslide are yet to heal. Expressing their worries and raising concern about their mental well-being. Wakati mungine nasikia, hii kiswa, inakuja na kivikiria, nasikia kama naniyuma. Tena, sijui tungwe kwa nini, inapanya nini. Ata jana nilishidwa na kukura hii sakura. As they pick up the pieces, their call to the government is Sirikali inaweza kutusikiria huruma watujegee kwa ajili kwangu si tuwezi kurudi ni kukaribu kwa maji ningepata pesa ni songe tu nitafute nyumba yangu niingie nikae vile nilikuwa nakaa maisha yangu na watoto wangu the plight of the victims in this camp mirrors the plight of those in other camps across the country. The unanimous call is for the government to step in and provide them with permanent settlements. Sheila Chelangat for TV 47 in Madare, Nairobi.